who knew I would make it this far, they hated, they never believed me. Never believe. yeah. I would never drop the ball, I know I make it look easy. Yeah. Mayweather with the defense, I don't care what a critic got to say, I got them picking up the pieces. Gotta me, you really playing with your life, I'm about to come and run it all back. Yeah. I'm the new era, about to snap back, you ain't fitting for it, cause you all cap like. Hold up, I shoot my shot, wait, hold up. I'm really about to run this, go up. You know it's all net when it go up. Hey, it's your girl, Laura Cowan, with Tea Time with Laura. Don't forget, it airs every Friday at 7 p.m. We're here today doing our documentary filming, B, a raised fist mixtape. If we don't get it, shut it down. If we don't get it, shut it down. I would like to at least point out one thing and make it perfectly clear. There has been no war crime that we can think of where from someone was gunned down, one person, 137 times. And we're here in the wonderful, wonderful art gallery of Deep Root Experience with the curator himself and owner, David. Say hi, David. What's going on, everybody? And David, kind of like fill us in about the rest of the artwork. You have more upstairs as well? Yeah, yeah. So we're a full-time art gallery working exclusively with black and brown artists, mm -hmm. uh, primarily in Cleveland, but we do have shows that invite artists from outside of that. Uh, the exhibition that we're in right now is called Dope Boy Chic, uh, and the concept of the show was for artists to explore uh, the experiences and impact of the Dope Boy persona as it was created during the late 80s and early 90s and the, the war on drugs that we all know infiltrated yeah. our community and, and was a terror. Uh, but, but in real time, there were certainly some, some positive things that came out of that. The collection is nine different artists, uh, all of them uh, residing in or being from Cleveland. Uh, all of the artwork is available for sale as well. Uh, we work with collectors uh, who are just beginning through payment plans, after pay. The goal is to start to encourage people to invest their money in black artwork and understand the investment of artwork as it's transitioning uh, to mainstream. We're checking out some of the artists here. We just got through what, uh, talking to Miss Asia Amore. She showed us her artwork, a fantastic piece. And right now we have another artist here, Krista. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, Krista, show me your piece that you were working on. Uh, one of my pieces in the show is uh, Goon and Bloom. And that's this piece right here. It's a digital painted piece and then it's printed on canvas. Exactly. So, so what gave you this idea to do this piece? I just really wanted a, to say it shortly. I wanted a more softer approach to what you might deem a thug. Like, just wanted it to kind of give off a more of a graceful vibe and more of a passionate vibe. So David, how can everyone get in touch with you? So we have open hours Friday from six to nine, Saturday and Sunday from three to six, but you can connect with us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at Deep Roots Experience on all of those spelled out completely. Uh, and you can email us info at deeprootsexperience.com uh, to schedule an appointment any other time to come by and check out the artwork. Fantastic stuff. So remember people, art is an investment and we need your investment. Come on down to Deep Root Experience. <laughs>